Man, I've been seeing everyone build these portable units and I decided I'm gonna build one too, but I wanna do a step above what other people are doing. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this, which is a waterproof, one of those tough boxes, and we're gonna turn this into a completely waterproof speaker. In fact, when we're done with this, you'll be able to drench this, dunk it, submerge it completely, and it will still be working. All right, without further ado, let's get building. All right, guys, so let me show you this box. This box is pretty cool. This box I picked up from Harbor Freight Tools. Oh. And it's very nice. It's got all foam insides. You know, these foam can be taken out, and they're kind of pre-cut if you see that. But you got a bunch of different foam pads in here, and then you have a, a completely foam bottom, which can come out, but you're going to want to keep that in there. Uh, and so we're going to use this box, and there will be a link to all the parts used in the description below, as well as uh, free build plans on my website, which you should definitely be checking out. All my plans are, are free on my website. Now, these are always free for your own personal use. If you want to sell these, you need to contact me. But let's show you some other things that we're going to be using. We're going to be using, of course, a power jack because we need to power it. Although this is going to be portable. That's just to charge the batteries. We're also going to need uh, some batteries. And we're going to use this LiPo battery pack. This is a Dayton LiPo battery pack. And we're also going to need an amplifier. And guess what? It is a Dayton amplifier. 2 by 15 watt Bluetooth amplifier. Because this is going to be a Bluetooth system. So we're going to use those. And guys, there's only a couple other things that we actually need for this project. We're going to use this power supply, which is a 19 volt 4.74 amp to charge the batteries when not in use. That's just to make sure that it's always completely charged. And last but not least, we're gonna need the speakers. Now that's where it gets really interesting. We're gonna talk about these real quick. We're gonna use these. Now you might be saying, what are those? Those are not speakers. Well, now that's what's so cool and that's what's gonna make this completely waterproof. It's gonna be as waterproof as this case can be. These are the BST um, transducers, all right? now. Most of the time when you see transducers like this, you think base shakers, but these are full range transducers, meaning that you peel this off, you stick it on anything, and it turns whatever it is into a speaker. And so we'll show you how that works here in a minute, but that's the pride and joy of this project. All right, guys, let's start cutting into this. You notice there's different thicknesses. Now this one is the thinnest one, and this one we're gonna put on top. So the reason why we're gonna do that is because when we start closing this, you're gonna see the speakers start to tense up, and I think we're gonna cut out holes for these. Um, that way they can go down nice and gentle and there's no pressure on those.
look at that perfect no water at all the case is fine I could have put my phone in there and I would have been fine the amp board everything man it's all good and as you see guys it is that easy to make a completely waterproof speaker all right guys if you enjoyed this video if you enjoyed this build please give it a thumbs up like and share with your friends. Go ahead and build something like this. You get all the parts right from Parts Express. All the parts are listed in the description, as well as a complete detailed log of how to build this in my website, 123toy.com. Please check that out for any free plans that I might have put out there. They should be on that website. All right, guys, thanks, and have a great day.